Hey guys, this is Martin Wright from Argos Dog Training. I have with me Orca here today. Orca is here for a 14 day board and train. She's doing very well. This is actually the seventh day of the board and train. The board and train program is a program in which I train the dog and then I give the owner lessons later on the language that we use in training. Um, it is a very successful program and dogs can be trained to a very high level using the board and train program. So today Orca and I are planning on working on place command. All right, so come with me. I have a few things set up. Let's go Orca. So place command is a safety command which allows the, us to put our dog in a position where they can be safe and to know that they will stay there. So that's the whole goal of the program, of this part of the program, of training this command. Your place board can be anything. Your placemat can be anything. Um, right now I have these boxes set up, these platforms and that one bucket, but really I want to be able to use anything at all and tell her to stay on it. This includes car mats, house mats, um, a t-shirt, a sweatshirt, whatever I have handy. First thing we do whenever we give a command, we wanna make sure we're clear to the dog. Right, so Orca, you ready? Hey, place. I point to the box and I make tension on the leash until she arrives on the box, all four paw paws. Excellent, and then I release my tension and I can reward her with food. Good job, Orca, good job. Okay, when it's time for her to come off the box, I let her know by telling her okay, and I show my hands to her. Excellent, Orca, let's go. Let's go, sweetie. Ready? Place. Good, good girl. Excellent. Good job, Orca. You ready? Place. Oh, uh, 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 uh. Let's go. Yes, good girl. Excellent. So you will see that dogs will make mistakes. It's important though that we end up getting them back on path, getting them back doing the thing that we would like them to do. Good girl. Excellent. Very good, Orca. Excellent dog. So usually when I do my place command, I try to get the dog to come off the mat in any way I can. Excellent. No, sweetie. No, sweetie. You got to go back. Yes. Good job. Excellent. Excellent. You're getting tired. I can see it. Orca, 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 she's pretty good at this place command. Place. But that's one of the things that we had to teach her is how to be calm and how to stay in one position. Um, Orca came here because she was aggressive or leash aggressive or leash reactive towards dogs. She has bitten a dog before um, in the past. So what she needs is she needs some kind of impulse control, a way to be able to control herself and keep herself together. So the place board, the place command will help a dog to develop that. Excellent. So you can see she's definitely a hunter. She's looking around, but you know what? She's staying on her, her board. Excellent, Orca. Very good girl. Very good. Good job, sweetheart. Excellent. Okay. Very good. And of course she gets to come to me often, so I get to pet her a lot. Excellent. Good girl. So when you're practicing with your dog, you wanna make sure that you don't practice too long. Um, and you wanna make sure that there's a definite end so that way they could go back to enjoying themselves. So at this point, Orca has done very well. She's practiced for a while. And now I'm gonna just have her release her and let her get back to her everyday life. Okay, Orca. Good job, sweetie. That's it. So remember, place command is a great way to help your dog to develop impulse control. If you like what you see today, definitely subscribe to our channel. If you really liked it, you could give us a thumbs up so others can find us easily. Below, you'll find a link to our Instagram page. Until the next time, enjoy your day and enjoy your dog. Gotta make sure my beard is in the Oh, this is going to the B-roll. The B-roll? Yeah. This right here? Yep. Okay.